News Leader starts now with a breaking news alert. And we begin this breaking news alert with a local police officer is out of the hospital after suffering a horrible head on crash early this morning. Thanks for joining us this noon. I'm Jen Pachano in Fort Nicole Versansky. That speeding driver slammed right into him while the officer was on a call. 19 News reporter Winnie Dorch joins us live from Willowick. Winnie, how did this happen? What was that driver doing? Well, that driver was a 25 year old man. He was trying to get away from East Lake Police, and then he ended up hitting a cruiser in Willowick. That stolen car was from East Cleveland. The incident happened around 3 30 a.m. East Lake and Willowick officers got an alert from the flock camera system telling them a stolen car was in their area. That car was spotted in East Lake first. That driver almost struck a police cruiser there. He was able to get away and drove into Willowick. A Willowick officer was already heading east on Willowick Drive. While the driver was going west, the officers slowed down, but the driver kept speeding and smacked into the officer's cruiser head on. Our officer was able to exit his cruiser uh, and even despite being injured, he was able to apprehend the driver of the stolen vehicle on foot after the driver tried to flee the scene and officers also located a stolen handgun. And again, that officer has been released. He is at home. He is banged up a little bit, but everything is fine as it stands right now. Another thing to mention, there was another man in the car with a 25-year-old driver. He did not attempt to run, and charges are expected to come in the days. I'm live in Willowick, Winnie Dorch, 19 News. Thank you, Winnie. Also 